just by simply applying it to my hands you can definitely see a huge difference hello everyone welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video hyperpigmentation on the skin spots blemishes all over your body a large patch or a very tiny patch such as a, a blackhead mark or even an acne scars today I'm gonna make a remedy and here it is this is a dark spot remover remedy now I just blend some wonderful dark spot remover ingredients ingredients that contains like sulfur and zinc and antioxidant and vitamins that will help to clear the skin of the hyperpigmentation very very fast so if you have large patches on your body if you have dark elbows dark knees dark inner thighs this is gonna help tremendously so come with me to the kitchen and i'll show you how to whip this up in no now here are some of the things that you're gonna need to effectively make this recipe you are gonna need a blender or a grater whichever either either you're gonna need a small bowl you're gonna need a strainer and you're also gonna need some cotton pads for application now let's move on to the ingredients now take a look at the first ingredient and as you can see here it is a red onion now if you do not have red onion you can choose to use the white onion or even the yellow onion just use whatever onion you have however I chose red onion today because the red onion have a slightly more antioxidant than the white onion the yellow onion also have an higher amount of antioxidant red onion is also loaded with sulfonic acid basically sulfur and this is what helped to clear the skin of dark spots and blemishes today this recipe is great for large dark patches not only small patches but if you have a large dark area on your body that you want to lighten this is what this remedy is for for, okay so definitely try to get some red or even the yellow onion for this recipe so first I'm just gonna peel off the outer layer of the onion like I'm showing here and I'm using only a half of this large onion today so I'm just gonna cut it in two halves and I take a look at this this is what it looks like and now I'm just going to rinse this off once rinse here it is and now I am gonna chop the onion for easier blending now at this stage if you do not have a blender go ahead and use your grater like this and just grate the onion however I have a blender so I am gonna be blending Now in spite of the fact that I'm using the red onion in this recipe, don't be afraid to use whatever onion you have. So now that we have our onions chopped, I'm going to place them in a, a blender. Uh, we're not going to add any water to this, we're going to blend as is. Now guys, before we blend our onion take a look at what I have here here I have some dried rose petal now the rose petal contains antibacterial properties it is also excellent for clearing the skin of dark spots and blemishes not only that roses are very hydrating to the skin it will have to lock that moisture in the skin making it a great ingredient for this dark spot remover but guess what guys roses also come with a bonus in that the fragrance is going to help to cut down on the strong smell coming from the onion so if you do not have dried rose petal you can use some rose powder 
or use your rose water or just use some rose water okay so next we are gonna be straining our blended onion now take a look at this this is what it looks like after it is blended if you ever blend onion and open it you're gonna see like smoke coming out of it that is from the sulfur from the onion so not to worry so we're gonna dump this in the strainer make sure to get everything out we're just trying to extract the juice here okay now once this is done we are just gonna press Squeeze it through the strainer. Squeeze. Now here it is. This is our freshly squeezed onion juice with a little bit of a rose petal. And, and this is about two tablespoons of onion juice. And now we are gonna move on to the rest of the ingredients. And take a look at what I have here. Here I have some carrot seed butter. In my opinion, carrot seed butter or carrot seed oil is one of the better oil to use for hyperpigmentation because it's of this high content of beta carotene. And beta carotene is really a fighter when it comes on to pigmentation on the skin. So for our carrot seed butter, I'm going to be using one teaspoon of the carrot seed butter and I'm just placing this in our onion. Our next ingredient is aloe vera gel, another wonderful ingredient for clearing the skin of hyperpigmentation, any form of a spots and blemishes, and it also helps to hydrate the skin. So I'm using store-bought aloe. If you have fresh aloe vera gel, it would be very suitable for this recipe. I'm using one teaspoon of the aloe vera gel in this recipe. Next, I'm moving on to another wonderful ingredient, and this is lavender essential oil. Another great ingredient for clearing the skin of spots and blemishes. So for our lavender essential oil, I'm gonna use about a half a teaspoon of lavender essential oil. Another essential oil for clearing the skin of spots and blemishes is lemon essential oil, 100 pure natural lemon essential oil or lemon oil. And I'm just using about a half of a teaspoon of the lemon oil. And now I'm just going to blend this together. Just mix well. At this stage, you can choose to pour this back in the blender and blend, which is what I'm gonna do, so that the oils could fully blend in the onion juice. I also have an optional ingredient, and this is rosemary oil. And rosemary oil is great for removing spots and blemishes. So I'm gonna use about a half a teaspoon of the rosemary oil. It is definitely an optional ingredient. So I'm just gonna pour this back in the blender. I'm just gonna cover, blend. And this is it. And this is your dark spot remover natural homemade remedy. Now guys, if we have smell of vision, you would be blown away to know that you're not getting this strong smell coming from the onion because we use the lavender and the rose petal in this. It's really cut down and that strong smell. Now this can be stored in the refrigerator for about seven to 10 days, a give and take. All right, so let me pour it and make sure to pour it in an airtight container. So let's just pour this out. Okay. 
we have a very strong lemony rosy smell coming from this now we take a look here it is this is your dark spot remover remedy now this is also great for acne scars it's great for your knees your elbows it is also great if you find yourself with butt acne this is great to use on it now to use this you are gonna apply it on your skin preferably with a cotton pad you can also choose to use a q-tip and what you do you dip in soak up the remedy a little goes a long way you really do not need a lot and wherever on your body that you find dark spots and blemishes you just apply it in a circular motion on that area and continue to rub it for about a minute or so okay just apply it there and take a look at what I'm doing here look right here where I'm rubbing it just by simply applying it to my hands you can definitely see a huge difference I do have a little bit of a tan going on so I know I'm noticing that it probably will help to get rid of a sun tan also okay so just apply it and this is not a rinse off once you apply it to your skin you are gonna leave it on for a couple of hours before you rinse off just continue to use this and before you know it you're on your way to clear skin that dark patch that you have on your body is going to slowly lighten lighten and then fade away it is not magic it's not going to happen after the first use although what i just did on my hands appear that that's what it's going to be but you got to use it on a regular to get the best result okay. so there you have it thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share the video share 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 and also leave your comments and if there's anything that you are currently using to clear your skin of hyperpigmentation feel free to share it in the comment box below thank you all and I'll see you in my next video bye bye